how to reverse a linked list. Here is the code which does that. The first thing is we have to check if the list is empty because if the list is empty we don't have anything to reverse. We have uh, three pointers which points to which then will point to elements in the linked list. I call them current node, next node and loop node. In the initial step current node is pointing to the head I mean to the start of the linked list. Uh, the next node will point then to the next element. And because we have to reverse the linked list this means that the first element will have to point to the, to the new because it, this actually will be the and the last element. So that's why we are, we are changing this uh, pointer of the head element to point to null. Then in the loop we have to uh, point the loop node to point to the next element of the next node, which is this one here. Then we have to point the next node to the head element, which is this link here. Then the current element is the next node element. It's pointing to the next node, next node element. Basically, current node is pointing to the end of the reversed linked list. But we have to have these uh, pointers in order to traverse the linked list. That's why now the next node will point to the loop node, which is this code here. And in the next step, while we're going through the loop, next node will point to the next element of the next node, which is this change here. Uh, then what happened then? Uh, next node will point to the yeah. We we just have to continue uh, pointing the next door element to the current element. Then because the current node is um, the next because the next node is actually all right. It's pointing to the correct element in the linked list, we have to uh, move current node to point to the next node and then what happens uh, next node will have to point to the loop node yes and then if we continue like that loop node will point to the next element and it continues like that till the current node uh, till the next node is uh, null when it's no, this means that we have reached the end of the linked list, which must be actually the head of the new linked list. That's why this will be assigned to the head node on the line here. And that's basically the algorithm. Thank you.